In this video, we're going to take a look at the buffer of geoprocessing. So here I have opened a shapefile of Shonargao. This shapefile is representing Shonargao and the prop points represent different places here. So what we're going to do is we have our barrier. You know, what is this? Baradi bus stop here. So for example, let's just say that uh, let's zoom into Baradi bus stop first. Here is Baradi bus stop. Okay, for example, let's say that a patient of COVID has used the Baradi bus stop here. He was found here. So, and according to the questioning that has been done to him, he is saying that he did not go over more than, uh, let's say, uh, 20 meters around Baradi bus stop before uh, he was discovered and taken into, a, taken into a hospital. Okay, so... Well, what we're going to do is we're going to buffer 20 meters of area around this Baradi bus stop. This is the Baradi bus stop, by the way. This point is representing Baradi bus stop. There you go. So we're going to buffer 20 meters around here to see that if any other uh, place of uh, local meeting has been affected by his presence or not. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to geoprocessing and then we're going to go to buffer. Now for buffer in input features, we're going to choose our Baradi bus stop there and the distance is going to be linear unit instead of decimal degrees, we want it to be in meters. So he said 20 meters. So let's just give 20 here and then click on OK. Now we have a new buffered feature. Let's close this one up, Baradi bus stop. Let's close the points as well. No, actually we need the points. As you can see that 20 meters has been buffered around this point. Let's zoom in here. So 20 meters, 20 meters around this uh, specific Paradi bus stop has been buffered here. So we can say that this place is the danger zone and anyone who has crossed this zone must immediately go to an hospital and get themselves checked up. So that is how you can buffer in GIS. Now, another thing we can do is we can measure it. Uh, where is our measure? Here we go. We have previously learned about measure. So we're going to see if it is of 20 meters radius or not from there to here. You can see the segment length is showing 0.02 kilometers, which means that it is the circle around this point is indeed of 20 meters radius. So it was quite accurate. You can say that. Let's cut that. Here we go. So that was it for this video. I hope you got to learn something new and thank you very much for watching. If you have found the video to be useful, please like and consider subscribing to the channel as it will enable me to make more videos like this one. Thank you.